Brain training smartphone apps are becoming more popular than ever, but can they help you stay mentally sharp? The Fox Medical Team's Beth Galvin has more on a local woman and an Atlanta hospital giving them a try. Anita Hilburn of Alvarada, who will turn 60 in July, says she's been trying to do everything she can to stay as healthy as possible as she ages. And I'm a vegetarian and I exercise. I felt like I was taking care of myself physically. But Hilburn, who has an autoimmune disorder that can affect her cognitive function, is trying to stay as mentally sharp as she can. So two years ago, she found a smartphone app called Brain HQ. She pays about $94 a year or just under $8 a month for a subscription. Brain HQ as I can explain it as succinctly as possible is um, an app to develop your cognitive skills, your memory, your organizational skills, your planning skills, your visual processing. Each morning, Hilburn plays a series of brain games that Brain HQ's creators say are clinically proven to improve cognitive function. And I'll say some days I am very reluctant to open it because it is very challenging. And you basically earn stars for your ability to process quickly, your ability to memorize, remember, your your ability to for spatial you know awareness the more accurately you do it the more stars you accumulate there's definitely no harm um, in kind of spending some focused time to work on a skill Diana Flores a speech language pathologist at Shepherd Center in Atlanta says they do use several brain training apps with their patients kind of as a way to kind of practice skills that we initially uh, discuss with clients mm -hmm. um, and then for them to kind of reinforce and get some practice ongoing at home. Also, sometimes we talk about using like your planner or your phone or so I think it's just one of the tools um, that we have to kind of help um, the skills that we're trying to reinforce. Flora says they try to match patients to the right app for their needs, encouraging them to use it regularly. I think it's like a workout program, right? Just like you're working out your other muscles, you're working out your brain. So I think it's the consistency with the use of it and also the guidance because every app is not appropriate for every patient. Hilman says she recently had a neurological assessment and she says she did pretty well. I'm in remission from my medical condition. Condition. That probably helps, but I think Brain HQ has helped a lot also. I really like it. I think it's very challenging, and I think if anybody were to decide to purchase it, they need to commit to using it because it does help. But it, it can be really time it can be time consuming. For your Fox Medical team, I'm Beth Galvin. <laughs>